Now we're doing question 71, and it turns out that Archimedes, who was one of the greats in mathematics, predicted that the area under a parabolic arch is two-thirds the base times the height. So we're going to find out if this is true. So <clears throat> here is the equation for our parabolic arch, and we're going to evaluate from negative b over 2 to b over 2. And so, oh, I want to point something out. This is an even term, because this is h times x to the 0 power. And 0 is an even value, so this term's even. This term's even, too, because this is x to the second, and 2 is even. So the phenomena is this, that if you evaluate an even function from negative a to a, and I'll just guarantee that this is even, make this a 2n dx, what you get is uh, you get identical areas on other side of, on opposite sides of the y-axis, so you can just double the uh, integral you get for the right side of the y-axis, and uh, you save yourself a little work. So you can this uh, change this to this. On the other hand, if you're talking about an odd function, and odd functions are symmetric about the origin, and I'll guarantee that this is odd, 2n plus 1 dx. And the areas of the two regions on either side of the x-axis are identical, but they're on also on either sides of the uh, y, I beg your pardon, on either sides of the y-axis, they have identical areas, but they're on opposite sides of the x-axis, so they're going to add out, and you just get a zero there, see? So, okay, with that in mind, we're going to take the integral of this even function from negative b over 2 to b over 2 of h minus 4h over b squared, and we've got an x squared there. And since it's an even function, we can just go 2 and change the limits from 0 to b over 2, and h minus 4h over b squared x squared dx. Now let's integrate that. We have 2. And the integral of h is going to be hx, and the, uh, then we have minus 4h b squared, and I guess we're going to get an x cubed over 3. Integral of x squared is x cubed over 3. Good. And we're going to evaluate that from 0 to b over 2. And so this equals now 2 times uh, hb, excuse me, hb over 2 minus 4h, and we've got a 3b squared, and then when we put b over 2 into x cubed, we get b cubed, and 2 cubed is 8. And now, when we uh, evaluate for 0, both these terms are go to, will go to 0, so uh, we're done. We just have to simplify, so we get 2 times h b, h is the height, b is the base, over 2, minus 2 times 4h b cubed over 3 times 8 times b squared. And notice b squared goes into b cubed b times. And 
these twos divide out, and by the way, two times four is eight, and the eights divide out, and we're left with HB over three. So we have HB minus a third of HB, and that equals two thirds of HB, height times base, height times base, which is just what Archimedes predicted.